Hey guys, how do you mean it's Uncle Joe? My name is Susan. Welcome to my channel. Today, I'll be reacting to Jutsu Kaisen episode 21. Yeah, who else is ready for some baseball? Oh my gosh. I saw the preview doing the previous episode and was like, wait, what? <laughs> I was so confused, like I, either this is gonna be like a filler episode or this is just a continuation and this is just gonna be another part of that entire exchange event. I just think it's the latter, like this is also gonna be part of that exchange event. So I'm very very excited. Um, this is gonna be again like so different from just Kaisen we've seen so far. But I think the battle against Hanami and the others are just over, you know, like we've seen that insane gojo moment in a previous episode like he handled everything by himself basically like almost everything and makito got the finger from skuna so i think all of that is just over and we're just gonna move on with the next part of the story there are only like a few episodes left so it's not gonna be very intense anymore i think so i'm just gonna enjoy it you know i'm very curious to see how they're gonna end this season i just hope and I'm kind of sure that there will be a season 2 someday because this show is like insanely popular. So yeah, I'm just very excited to see how this is gonna go, how they're gonna end this season. So yeah, without further ado, let's just hop right into the episode. So let's go! Alright, I'm ready. So I'm gonna start the episode in 3, 2, 1... Oh, this dude, he was so random. <gasps> oh my god, Hanami still survived. Maybe, or not. Wait, what? This Makito. The ominous soundtrack. Damn. Makito was not kidding though. What's the other thing? Also, Skuna Finger? Oh, you got all six of them! Oh, I don't know what that is, but that doesn't look good either. Back to the private beach. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, this was all before the entire battle. Oh. 
Yep. Uh oh, yeah, Megumi. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, we know. We know his eyes are pretty. <laughs> Oh yeah, there's a lot of like foreshadowing of what's to come in the future. I'm so surprised that Hanami survived that attack. Oh yeah, that's the continuation of their conversation from the previous episode or the one before, I don't remember. <laughs> oh yeah, the baseball, we're gonna see that today. Oh Oh yeah, this guy. Oh, a new character. Ooh. Mm 
Yeah, also like those curse spirits such as Jogo and Hanami, they're all based on like fear for natural disasters and stuff. So that actually really makes sense. They're brothers. <laughs> Just eating pizza together, nice. He's so pretty. Was he there all this time? Brata! <laughs> no. <laughs> oh no. Hey there. <laughs> It's not your fault. just participating I'm not even surprised <laughs> Kama is so injured. <laughs> Reliably crazy. <laughs> yep. That's the perfect description. Reliably crazy. <laughs> Yeah. Shocky. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I'm so happy to see all of them just being alright, you know? 
Like, there's still some injured people there. But most of them are alright. Baseball. <laughs> of course, it was Gojo. <laughs> and that's how we're back to this moment. Okay, go Miwa! Nice! Can they use their powers? Oh, you still gonna play? a little bit distracted. <laughs> this is so great. It's so, so lighthearted, you know? Make a model, yeah. <laughs> 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 okay, go make me. Nice. Oh. <laughs> Wants to punch a zebra one day. What was that? <laughs> oh, sister versus sister. Oh, never mind. Yeah, still. Make him out is still the picture. It's gonna be a home run? <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, caca! <laughs> oh, it's still zero for zero. Ha <laughs> ha 
<laughs> Brata. Might be. Oh, back to serious conversation. Ooh, this episode is amazing. <laughs> exactly. Interesting how he was showing that though. Okay, back to the match. Just show me the match. <laughs> yes! Yes! <laughs> nice one! Exactly. Let's, let's just enjoy the moment, you know? <laughs> oh, every, all of them are just so precious. Oh. <gasps> A home run? Yes. Oh yeah, Tokyo won. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh, this episode was so nice. This is what we needed after that and then that entire intense battle, you know. I was like laughing the entire time watching that baseball match. Seeing everyone just goofing around with each other. They're all just so precious. Like all they all need to be protected. <sighs> also the ones from the Kyoto school, by the way. Did you sample rice or bread? For me, rice. <laughs> Panda's watching again. <laughs> Wait, 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 what? 
Oh, th oh, things are gonna get intense again. Damn. All right. So that was episode twenty-one of Jutsu Kaisen. This episode was just so good. Like I really, really enjoy like all the serious episodes, like with the intense battles and fighting and everything. But these episodes where it's all about like all these students interacting with each other. That's what I really enjoy about the show. You know, they like this is something I've mentioned already many times. Like these, all of these characters just feel so real, so relatable. You just feel like you're watching a real group of high schoolers that you can just picture in real life as well. So seeing them all just play baseball together, it was just, they didn't even use like their powers, right? Just um, Ninomiya, she's the only one who in the end used her powers, but like all the others, they were just like, just playing normal baseball. But just their personalities just really shined and they were just all like messing around. Um, even Mikamaru joined in, but as the pitcher, you know, <laughs> oh, that was so great. Like, it's just so good to see everyone. Like, even that, like, little moment between Yuji and um, Kamo. You know, they were talking about Yuji's reasons for becoming a Jutsu sorcerer. Yuji said in a very simple way why he's doing all of this, how it has led to him becoming a Jutsu sorcerer. And I think he really gave a nice summary. And I think that was something that Kamo could relate to as well. Like he was thinking back to his last conversation with his mother. And maybe that gave him some closure as well, you know. Something that made him look a bit more forward as well. So that was like a little conversation, but very, very sweet. But then we just continue with the baseball match, you know. Like Kamo got a strike out. So, <laughs> so that was basically it. But like in this episode, I really like the balance between the serious moments and like the silly, funny moments. You know, like this episode had a perfect mix. Like we even started off with the curses, you know, the before the OP even. Like they were talking about the plan. There was probably just a flashback of what they were discussing before the entire attack, you know. And after the OP, we focused entirely on that baseball match. Just to let them enjoy life for a moment. Like they've all been through so much and they just need some moment of relaxation as well. But there's still some issues going on. Like also within the curses side, like they not just retrieved Skuna's fingers. They also stole something else. Which I'm not really sure about what that is, but I'm sure we'll get to know that in the future as well. Maybe in the next episode already, like judging from the preview, the next episodes already get quite dark, which I didn't really expect. Like there are only a few episodes left, so I don't know. I just didn't really expect things to go down already. <laughs> but on one side, it's also very exciting. So I'm still very looking forward to that. And there's definitely more going on, like also Gojo. He seemed a bit worried, you know, like he was like, yeah, something doesn't feel right. Like there's something just missing, you know, he's just a bit worried of what's to come. And I think he's totally right to think that as well. Um, so this episode also gave a lot of foreshadowing of what we can expect in the future from Mahito and the others. So yeah, that's something to look forward to as well. Like this episode was just a very nice bridge episode. Like it really gave closure to the previous intense battle, but it also gave some hints to what we can expect in the future. I also really liked in this episode that um, little moments in which Yuji, Megumi and Nobara were sitting together eating pizza. You know, I just really love that moment because like those three they're of course the ones who started off this entire show. Even though they don't know each other for such a long time, they've already been through so much and they became so close in such little time. And of course, like for a long time, Nobara and Megumi thought that Yuji died. So their reunion, even though that was a little bit anticlimactic, you know, when Yuji revealed that he was alive. I don't remember which episode it was, but you know, that was a little bit anticlimactic, right? You ex you would expect a very emotional reunion, but that wasn't really there. But you can still see that they really, really were so happy to have Yuji back and they're still like so close. So seeing them just chill together at the hospital, eating pizza together, like even if it's something so small, it's just so great to see them just being themselves you can just see that they're still so close and of course not to forget Toto <laughs> I love how Toto is like going off to Yuji the entire time like brother remember those times from middle school 
<laughs> like Toto is just mixing up reality with his imaginations or fantasy. I don't know, like he's a little bit confused in that sense, you know, like he didn't even go <laughs> to the same middle school as Yuji. So he's amazing. Like you just cannot not love him, you know? And also during that baseball match, it was just ridiculous how he got like smacked by that baseball. Just so great. Yeah, overall this episode was just so, so, so enjoyable. I really, really loved it. So that was my reaction. I hope you enjoyed it. So if you did, please give this video a thumbs up. And if you can see my other reaction on videos, please check out my channel and subscribe. So in any case, thank you all for watching. And I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.